In today's video, we have this interesting interview problem. We have square root of square root of 36 minus square root of 20. And we have to simplify this without using any calculator. But before we begin, feel free to pause the video and try this first. Done? Cool. Now let's get started. First, let's keep the big square root and then simplify this whole thing. Square root of 36 is 6 minus square root of 20 could be written as square root of 4 times square root of 5. And we can also simplify this as square root of 6 minus 2 square root of 5. And now you can see we can't simplify anything again. So what we're going to do is to remember one of the identities, which is a minus b all squared is equal to a squared plus b squared minus 2ab, right? So we're going to manipulate this whole thing to get something like this. Now let's put our big square root down. This says could be written as 5 plus 1. Then we have minus 2 square root of 5. And we can also write this as square root of 5 is also the same as square root of 5 all squared plus 1 could also be written as 1 squared. Then we have minus 2 square root of 5. And now we can compare this whole expression to what we have here. We can see that square root of 5 is a, 1 is b, then we have this one to be a, but from this whole thing we don't have b. So we can multiply this one by 1 so that this will be our b. And it's the same thing, right? And now you can see we can write this whole thing in the form a minus b all squared. So we have a to be square root of 5 and b is 1, then all squared. And remember, we still have our big square root, so we will put it down. Straight away, we can see that this square will cancel this square root, and now we have square root of 5 minus 1, which of course is the final answer to this problem. So guys, I hope you found this video useful. Smash the like button and also subscribe to this channel for more videos. Thanks a lot for watching. See you again on the next video.